How you doing? I'm Chris Myers from Humphreys McGee. I'm here to explain a couple of the songs from the new album Death by Stereo. One of the tracks is called Search For and I'm going to explain a little bit about the my interpretation of the hits and fills of the intro parts. There is this guitar section, this riff where they're playing very short staccato kind of notes and it's just all 16th notes but they finish with a high end a high note in the uh, register, so it starts out like So basically what I'm trying to do is, as a drummer, interpret that figure and that phrase as best I can. Um, since it's the strongest, probably biggest accented uh, part in the, in the whole song, I'm going to play the, probably the, the heaviest accented part of the, uh, the drum set, which is the kick drum, and still keep a pulse. So basically, I'm going to pick up on the on the and of four, uh, the uh of four actually. So it's uh, one e and a two e and a three e and a four e and a. Uh. So I pick up on the uh, the uh before the down. So I come in like this: one, two, three, four. So that's basically the idea of what I'm doing to simplify. But then when I start opening it up towards the beginning and end of the song. I start to kind of variating with some fills, and I'll just kind of start out thinking of the, the riff from low to high in, in terms of the, the notes. So I'll play lower notes in the floor toms and then play higher notes for the snare, <coughs> for accents. <coughs> so I'm thinking this. One, two, three, four. basically going into the verse, that last part, I, I was basically playing upbeats and uh, not necessarily laying down the downbeat on the one because the riff goes into the verse going verse three, four. So what I have to do is try to accent those and still keep a, a, a pulse going. So basically that last part was three and four and so that's how I interpreted the figures and rhythmic accents going into the verse <clears throat>